Let's just start with the reading for the collective. Take what resonates, not the rest. We have a tower here. Wow, nine of swords and a tower. So somebody is, I feel like someone's afraid. Something big is happening. Really big. This could be um, a revelation, some huge shocking event, shocking news, shocking um, shake up, a fearful event, someone's afraid, um, something could be coming out about someone. <sighs> I mean, this could be a, a huge realization. This could be um, a foundation that was built on lies or ego that's falling. And it's uh, someone is just, there's no doubt about what's happening. Um, something could be really crumbling around someone or a group of people. So that's what's going on. Um, yeah, this could be a group of people that are very nervous. Um, hope that everyone is feeling good. Great. I appreciate all of your positive energy uh, very much. It's an honor to read for you. Wheel of Fortune. So, okay, so something's working out in your favor. I feel like this is positive. Positive change, good karma. I feel like it's being in flow in the flow with the universe. Um, this has to do with somebody who's been trying to win at all costs. I feel like they have to put the swords down. It's the way you've handled a situation. You could be this queen of wands. Just a warm personality, independent, creative, confident, um, passionate, enigmatic. Something's working out for you um, in a very positive way. Let's see. Page of Pentacles reverse. So someone could realize that, you know, they withheld something from you and now they're seeing things work out for you and want to be a part of it. Um, this could be someone who feels like they're not getting something that you're getting. Someone could have um, done something behind the scenes, something corrupt business-wise. Um, someone could have tried to block an opportunity. Um, some sort of bad business deal. Um, this could be someone trying to withhold some type of evidence of something, um, stand in your way, um, create obstacles. Um, maybe someone doesn't want you to get an opportunity or uh, doesn't want you to get an offer, a proposal of some sort. Um, someone who tried to take away your potential. Um, I feel like this person, they're going through a tower, or these people are going through a tower. It could be a revelation about what they've done. It's, it's them that is, they were hurting themselves the whole time. We have a page of cups reverse under the deck as well. So this would be just very childish energy here. Um, this feels like maybe a lot of overindulgence. Um, and then there's something about, this keeps coming out, this Knight of Swords. Something happening quick, someone making bold moves. Um, could be like a hero energy or this is you moving quickly, um, someone could want to move, come towards you quickly, um, 
or someone is coming towards you quickly. Deep down, Six of Wands. So, someone's feeling like you won or um, you're being celebrated or that's what this is going to lead to. So there could be some sort of shocking news coming out here and someone feels like they lost control of a situation. Nine of Pentacles Reverse. This could be someone who is... Like a, a person that wants reward without effort. So somebody cutting corners, cheating to get ahead, maybe at your expense. Um, this could be someone who who um, tried to block your opportunities. They want reward without effort. Uh, but you're a queen of pentacles. You put in the effort. You nurture things. You nurture people. You have healthy boundaries. You have something to offer here. Um, and you're very grounded. So there's some diligence here um, to what you do. So if there is good fortune, it's not like you didn't co-create with the universe. Here, you're steadfast. So whatever this is, you deserve it. Um, there could be people who are trying to say you weren't this. And that could be part of the revelation. You could be a business owner. Um or have a good position at work, or just very steady, but also um, well-rounded. This is like a homemaker as well. Um, so, definitely someone you want on your side, I would feel like. Um, and I feel like that's what some someone, Six of Wands, you feel like you win, or this is gonna lead to some sort of celebration, being, being loved by many. Um, whatever this event is, I feel like this is some sort of positive change. This could be happening. You could be aware of it, um, or you're just in the flow, but you put the effort in and you take right action. That's why, that's one of the reasons why it's not just like something fell into your lap here, but there's a grander design to this whole thing. And I feel like there's some sort of realization about that. Um, someone could have tried to cut corners to get what you have. Um, wow, justice in the recent, justice reverse in the recent past. So, someone could have taken some sort of action in the recent past, something unjust. I feel like that tower could be it immediately backfiring. They did something unfair. Um, and that could be the revelation, something backfiring here immediately. Wow. <clears throat> They took some sort of unjust action and they're already receiving bad news. Page of Wands reverse. This happened quickly. And I feel like there's a group involved. Um, I think they had some sort of a plan uh, that backfired. Um, they could feel like something's unfair. Um, about you or your life, and they might want what you have, um, and been doing some less than stellar things to take it from you, block, block it. Nine of Wands reverse as an expectation or intention, so it could go either way. Someone is either intending on bullying or um, taking some sort of actions that are um, lacking in meaning um, just to prove a point or just very obstinate or stubborn um, because they see the will is in the upright um, or this is someone who who is it quits um, this could also be someone, yeah, who feels like they want to stop you from being so diligent. I have to clarify, but we have Seven of Cups under the deck. So someone is trying to figure out their options. Um, there could be some confusion here. Um, near future. Here we, here we have the same person again, Nine of Pentacles Reverse. So this could be someone who can't take care of themselves, or someone who refuses to do something on their own. They could be trying to take take what you have 
um, someone that wants reward without effort. That's Nine of Pentacles reverse. They want to skip steps. They might not have put the work in, but they want the results. Um, this could be someone that's in competition with you. Um, there could be an Emperor reverse involved. Six of Pentacles reverse, somebody abusing their power. Um, this could be someone who feels like they deserve something that you have and could be trying to skim off the top. This could be someone who is finding themselves in a compromised position where they need to beg, beg for something. Um, yeah, this person, you've got someone here that's in very toxic energy, um, lower vibrational energy, materialistic, jealous, addicted to some sort of pattern here. Um, so definitely someone in, in devilish energy. Um, I don't think it has to do with attraction uh, or anything like that. Um, but they could be a lustful person, but I don't feel like that's what it's about with you. I feel like it has to do with jealousy and obsession, uh, materialism, bondage, um, trickery. Um, this person could have given their power away. Um, trying to skip steps. All they want is, you know, to be satiated. They could be very hedonistic as well. They could have some type of substance use issue um, or issues. Um, the lens that someone's looking through here. Queen of Pentacles in the upright, Nine of Cups reverse. Yeah, it's like they see you as very solid, respectable, well-balanced person. Um, it's almost like you know where you're headed. You're headed towards what they feel in their subconscious, whoever this is. Knight of Cups reverse. This person could be partying a lot and watching you. Um, or they feel unhappy, they feel like they're not experiencing a dream come true, but they're watching you be very solid. Um, they could be in some sort of dysfunction, dysfunctional group, there could be a whole group involved, unhappy people. Um, watching you heal from something that I feel like they did. Um, and now they feel stuck or trapped. <clears throat> in the environment, some situation that's affecting this person, these people, or something in the energy that's, um, or how they appear to others. Um, three of Cups reversed. They seem like a, kind of, this feels like a messy social situation. Some sort of third party situation or social dynamic that's falling apart or maybe people who can't be depended on. Um, yeah, it's a group. There's a group here. Um, Seven of Wands reverse. A lot of things could be coming at these people from all directions. A lot of energy, a lot of... It feels like a lot of, you know, things backfiring at this group of people. And they, they could be information as well. They can't defend themselves from this. It's got something to do with you and unconditional love as well. Um, there could be someone here who um, loves you unconditionally. Um, there could be someone who's feeling, uh, or yeah, a lot of nostalgic memories. Um, so the fan just went off by itself. Uh, It was actually kind of warm in here, so it feels good. Um, but if you hear that, that's what that is. Um, hopes and fears of whoever this is. The sun, something coming to life, or someone being happy. Your happiness. 
um, you being seen, um, self-expression, happy self-expression, um, outcome for whoever this is. Two of Wands. So this has to do with making plans, some type of... Someone could be interested in your plans, or you're making plans with someone. Um, Three of Pentacles, it feels like maybe some sort of group effort. This could have to do with business. Ten of Wands, reverse. Someone could be... Someone could be letting someone go. Letting something go, letting this group go. You could be letting a burden go. Um, this could also be the other way, where there's like a guilt and shame connected to some group of people. Um, really weighed, weighed down. But it feels like there are, there's someone here that still wants to... kind of carry something out here. Someone very um, obstinate. They see something working out in your favor. There's a whole group involved. So let's get detail. What was the injustice? What are they planning to do here? Um, what does this person want? What is the significance of this person that wants reward without effort? Or is this them? They can't take care of themselves. What is it that people are seeing about this Three of Cups reverse? This group of people? Um, definitely someone has their eye on you, for sure. What's working out in your favor? There was something unfair that someone did here. So, um, yeah. I just want to say thank you for your, your sweet messages, your donations. Thank you for letting me know when the messages resonate. I appreciate that. Um, so... This could have to do with a matriarch, a mother figure. Someone's looking at your life. There's all this hope here. There's a thief. I don't know what they tried to steal from you. Your life path, your joy, your hope. Yeah, your hope. Since that's what they're so worried about. Someone who wanted to kill your spirit, maybe. They didn't want you to get an offer. Maybe they wanted... They, this is someone that wants reward without effort. Nine of Pentacles reversed. That's a thief. They want to take something from someone else without putting in the work. There's a thief here. Okay, there's actual money involved. <clears throat> they could be looking at your money. I have this old woman under the deck again. So, and there's something about someone's loyalty to you and the thief not being able to steal something. Wow. A jealous thief? Someone's jealous of you. Someone's jealous of you. They weren't able to steal something. Things are working out in your favor. Old woman came out again. So, this involves some mother figure or a matriarch. This could be your mother. This could be an, any feminine energy that's older than you. Um, misfortune. Wow. I feel like that's the tower. There's something going wrong. Wow. Something's backfiring here, and there's a whole group of people involved. Something's backfiring for all of these people. Um, Page of Pentacles reverse. This could be a leader of an organization. This could be someone that a lot of people go to for advice. This could be, um... Yeah, someone's mother. Um... P 
Page of Pentacles reverse. Um, something is... They're not getting something. Uh, they tried to block a proposal. This has to do with some sort of spiritual energy. have to do with a child? Spiritual energy around a child? Someone, someone who's very haughty is in sorrow. This could be your mother? They hate that you're this peacock. <laughs> this is someone who's false. Um, maybe you're, I don't know, this child could be your purity or innocence. It could also be a new beginning for you. It could be something you've conceived of. Some sort of prayers around a child. Um, Deep down, someone wins. They win, they're gonna be celebrated. Um, and it's like, this person's your your enemy, or they, they're watching it. They hate it, they, it's, you're the sweetheart, they can't stand it. That they have to let something go that's superficial. And there's some sort of celebration or party around your gift. And I feel like that's the Six of Wands. There's a celebratory energy. You're being celebrated. Something around a gift that you have or you're being something you're being gifted. There's something about a marriage. Someone not marrying you. Someone not helping you. And a bunch of money. Someone feels like they didn't learn something or see something. Justice in the... Re Justice reversed in the recent past. Someone did something unjust. It has to do with someone's loyalty in the recent past. Um, some sort of conversation that maybe went awry about someone not helping you or someone not helping someone. Nine of Wands reversed. Somebody is going to keep going or someone gives up. Um, Someone's going to be very obstinate, or somebody can't. Someone is going to give in. Constancy reverse. Okay, so someone's going to give in. Someone can't keep going. Or, okay, someone's going to help you. There's something about someone and their ego about the situation. You could be ruffling someone's feathers. Someone can't stand you being this peacock. You're not a peacock, you're you're a human being. You're, you're an earth angel. So I mean it is possible someone wants to stop someone from being constant, but my first instinct was someone knows that someone's got to quit doing something. Someone, I got to clarify that still. It has to do with, with whatever, there's an intention here and it has to do with whatever this Nine of Pentacles reverse is here. Someone didn't get what's yours. Uh, there's a gold digger here, it has to do with money. Someone's looking at your money. Nine of Pentacles reverse. Someone is not someone's friend. Something about friendships and loyalty is very big here. 
for someone being inconsistent, someone is not someone's ally, someone not coming towards someone, someone not visiting someone. Maybe someone can't message someone. Someone sees you as a queen of pentacles. They don't, either they don't want you to be happy. There's something about you being smug. Um, you're not sick. Or someone's trying not to be sick. Someone can't talk to someone or this conversation's going badly. Someone's not interested in something superficial. Something's not a dream come true. Someone won't message someone. Someone won't re reply to a message. Three of Cups reverse. This is either like a third party situation or some sort of social dynamic that has gone awry. Um, I feel like it might be this one. Yeah, conversation reverse. Someone doesn't, won't talk to someone or this conversation's going badly. Uh, it could have to do with a masculine energy from your past and something about money. Someone won't talk to someone. This conversation's going bad. Um, it's a bad conversation. It has to do with money. There's a matriarch or someone's mother here. Someone won't talk to someone. Someone's looking at things working out in your favor or something that's faded. Son, someone's afraid something's coming to light or that you're going to be happy. It's something about your self-expression, you expressing yourself, people seeing you joyful. Um, something about someone's wife. Maybe something coming to light about someone not being someone's wife or a problem with someone's wife or someone divorcing this person something coming to light or something about someone's wife being in sorrow some sort of someone's in sorrow they're dealing with misfortune they're very upset there's something going wrong here prison Someone is stuck or trapped in a situation. They're in a lot of sorrow. They're dealing with a lot of misfortune. Um, and someone's worried that it, maybe that they're going to connect it to this wife. Or this wife is the one that's going through this problem. And someone could be afraid it's going to come to light. Or that it's going to make you happy find something out. <clears throat> Definitely someone's worried about you being happy. Um, there's something about someone not wanting you to get a message or not see a message or someone not message you. Um, two of Wands, someone's making some type of plans. Um, they've got to figure out which way to go. Someone yeah, who, who, and where, and what, and once they know, they can make a move. Um, they gotta make a choice. It has to do, it's not a surprise. It has to do with this young woman here. It's a misfortune, there's some sort of misfortune here. There seems to be a misfortune, everyone's going through something here. But it's not a surprise. There's a lot of misfortune in this outcome. I don't know if this is a third, third party. It's not the, I don't think it's this wife. This could be a family member. A si sibling, a cousin. Um, co-worker.
someone's making plans, it's not a surprise. We have despair under the deck next to Ten of Wands, so I feel like someone is very shamed and burdened by something. So this is all about loyalty and friendship, something's going horribly awry. It can also be about someone being faithful to someone. It's like you, someone really admires you, or it's, they can't get around something here because you're this Queen of Wands and a Queen of Pentacles. So someone might have tried to box you in based on the way you look or your independence. But the problem is, is that you are actually, you know, very grounded and diligent as well. And there's money, there's something about money. Um, you have money, you're, you're independent, you're, you're a good catch. I feel like it has something to do with choices. Um, okay, so let's see who this is. Um, so this is about, this is someone who's been trying to come for you. And then there's someone advocating for someone who's been coming for you. There could be someone advocating for you. This is about being chivalrous. Someone took some type of a gamble here. It could be addictions, addictive behavior. And there's someone here being a hero, heroine. It could have to do with writing or something that someone wrote they shouldn't have written something down or they're writing something or someone's not receiving this letter or this information. Someone could have tried to block some type, some type of information about someone's feelings for someone. Someone has some sort of addictive patterns going on. Try to block someone from moving forward. Um, someone is rebelling or someone felt like something was edgy. Yeah, someone's out for a fight. Someone's fighting someone. But the thing is, is that someone can't get their fill off of your energy. And that, but someone really, it's your money. Your money. Someone's looking at your money. Someone only cares about money and you're this regal feminine, it's almost like it doesn't matter to you, but it, it does because it's the smart way of looking at things. You respect your money, you respect your things, but that's not what you're after. You won't martyr yourself for someone. You're not giving away your power. You're not gonna make yourself small to make others feel better about themselves. There's someone here that's been comparing themselves to you that wants to be better than you. I feel like they've been putting you down. Someone here was teaching someone something and it's not, they're not a leader. It's like they act like they're a leader, but they're not. Now they need something. Someone needs something here. There could be something about pasta that's significant right at this moment for someone. This has to do with lovers, someone being a lover. This is a something about a relationship. Someone trying to destroy you. Yeah, there's this damsel energy under the deck. So this is mostly I feel like someone is looking at your love life and your money. And this is someone who um it's almost like they had someone advocating for them trying to destroy you, like a mother figure, um, to replace you or be better than you or something like that. Destroy you, get rid of you, addicted to doing it. They only care about money. Um, they, this person puts on some type of an act. Like they're, um, it's about being, it's like these feminine archetypes, manipulation around feminine archetypes. Um, 
but they only care about money. Um, this person plays a lot of games. They want to be better than you. Um, Yeah, they, they base their self-worth on comparing to you and they feel fine as long as they have more than you or someone chooses them instead of you, but it's all like a game. It's all, um, there's something about them being a leader, um, having the right answers, being respectable, all of those types of things, putting you down. There's this like a gold digger energy, someone that wants reward without effort. They want what you have instead of you. They want, but the pro and they've been trying to, they've been putting you down. There's something about, you know, if someone pursues you or, um, loves you or is attracted to you or admires you, they want to say it's just because of your looks or that it's like, um, they try to devalue you based on your looks, but the problem is, you know, you are actually the whole, you're the whole package, but they've been trying to make it as if you're not, you're not this queen of pentacles. And, and even if, you know, you, you were, you're not, but just even if you were a queen of wands only, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that at all, but it's like they've been trying to, you know, use your, your beauty or your confidence or your independence against you. It's like you could be very warm and people might be drawn to you, um, you could be very attractive, something like that. Um, and it's like they've been trying to say that that is, you know, a lesser choice because people can't see past the surface that choose you and they're the ones that have all of the sort of either like cultural uh, experience or a better job or something like it's some, they're smarter or you know, it's like trying to make people feel small or make someone feel small for choosing you as if you're, you're just only about one thing or that someone's only, um, lustful if they, they thought this could be this mother figure that's been saying this, that you're only good for one thing or you're not someone that you choose for marriage or something like that. But the thing is, is that you're, you're not only this enigmatic Queen of Wands, but you are also a Queen of Pentacles. And that's what someone's been trying to, um, you know, they've been trying to cut you down. <clears throat> someone's been in competition with you and trying to cut you down. But you really are, you really are that magnificent. You know, you've got a lot going on for you and someone's been trying to take that from you, belittle you, devalue you, and take the things that um, really stand out about you and turn them upside down, ruin them, ruin things that are, you know, very special or unique about you and um, make, try to twist it. You know, you really are the full package. You have a lot to offer. You're very enigmatic or very, you know, beautiful, or there's, you're very, there's something about you very, um, you know, you inspire passion in others, but you're also this grounded, nurturing, giving person that's got a business mind, you know, someone here has been trying to devalue you or take that from you and there's something about this that is it's um it's being turned upside down because someone has been so careful about trying to uh someone could be very um 
also very uh, bigot bigoted as well. There could be bigotry involved here. Um, you know, race, culture, religion, um, just low, lower vibrational judgments, judgment. Um, and you're not trying to prove anyone wrong, but you're just being you. Um, and if anything, this has been, it's created more merit for you because you've had this whole group working against you and you still, um, came out very balanced here. You're coming out very, very balanced in spite of, you know, these people and this person and, you know, someone working against you and competing with you and trying to take what you have instead of you. And there's even more irony here too, because nine of pentacles reverse, this is someone who wants reward without effort. So they're the last person who should be trying to devalue you, but it's like, they want to say they're better than you, but they're trying to skip steps. They're cheating to get ahead, trying to put you down. You know, you put in the actual effort. You're very dependable. You could be also, you know, a very good cook as well you know, good at designing, you know, your home might be very, very comfortable, a warm atmosphere, um, just a really beautiful mix. And, you know, you could be doing a lot at once and there could be financial gain from your efforts. So there's a stark difference between you and this person and you've been diligent, you're look, you seem to be aware of them. It's almost like um, you've incorporated this person or these people into your business plan or your, your schedule or the way you operate. It, they're just like a piece of the scenery, you know? You're, you're aware, but you're not focused on them. So, if someone had, there's just irony here and it's not too hard to see that if someone had embraced you from the very beginning, how um, great it would be for multiple people. This, you're, there's no reason, no reason at all to try to, oh, the battery went out. Um, yeah, there's no reason to ostracize you. And I feel like that, you, yeah, you're also this healer so you might not wear this energy on your sleeve. People might not look at you and automatically assume this about you. But it's like your energy, I feel like you, you know, people tend to do well around you. I think you have like a natural ability to sort of heal situations or help people find answers quickly. Or it could be, you know, you have some sort of spiritual business or something like that as well. It doesn't have to be though, it's your energy so on top of everything else, it's like they're, they, they've been trying to destroy someone that is, I feel like also you're very romantic and loving as well. You know, your base, your nature. Someone could have been trying to destroy your relationships here as well. It's very unjust. That's why it's coming out, justice reverse. And I feel like that's why you know, there's shame attached to it. Because it, it is so unjust and so unnecessary. It's just like... For you, it probably feels like... Just very random, like... You know, it's helped you grow, but... It just feels like random chaos that you'd have these people focused on you and, you know, all this competition, but it's probably connected to, you know, there's something to do with, there's someone here from your personal life. This, this happened, there's somebody connected to you. Uh, this could be your mother or this could be an ex and, uh, you know, their mother or an ex and this mother figure that's the mother of like this wife um you know it's like someone trying to 
I feel like definitely there's um, someone advocating for someone instead of you is what it's been. And they went too far. It's like someone wanted to take your place. Someone went way too far with this. Um, and there's some sort of weird jealousy too of your happiness. Um, why is this old woman here? There's something about an organization, birth reverse. I don't know, pregnancy. This is something about pregnancy. Maybe you're pregnant or something about someone's health. Something about someone being in good health. You're in good health. Somebody was creating an illusion here. Trying to create an illusion about you. And this is all for status. It's like someone was saying you weren't deserving somehow. But you very, you very much are deserving. There's no question. Um about this and there's something about some type of like affair or romance here someone trying to use their influence i feel like someone was trying to keep you stuck or trapped using their influence to try to keep you stuck or trapped i think you're the whole package here this is very unjust old woman will of fortune something is aligned for you there's positive change here. Something about this red lamp is very disturbing. Um, something, something about the red lamp. Quarrel, reverse. Someone won't fight with someone. Someone doesn't believe someone. Something about an affair. Something about someone in bad health. Someone has to be careful. Um, child. Child. It's got to do with your, something that's yours. Someone being independent, someone not listening to these people. Someone thinking for themselves, someone admiring you for being unique. Um, you being, marching to the beat of your own drum, your Something you've conceived of. Someone trying to block you or stop you. Someone can't dominate someone here. There could be something about religion as well. Someone can't sell someone a dream. Someone can't um, force someone to think a certain way. Someone's in their, their ego here. They took some type of a gamble. Um, and someone's asserting themselves about something that's very unprincipled. Yeah, this lie is over, or someone sees through the lies. Something about a romance. Yeah. Um, deep down, someone feels like what's bothering them the most is like, it's like an enemy watching you be celebrated or win. That's what's bothering them the most. Health reverse, for some reason, it has to do with someone's health. Um, and someone not being able to dominate someone. You're not isolated. You, it, something's coming out publicly. Or this is about you being seen. Someone has a real problem with you being seen. Seen and happy. Seen in good health, glowing, happy, unique, grounded, financially stable, um, attractive, unique, independent. Um, the whole package. Because I feel like somebody's trying to been trying to devalue you um, and use all of their power to do it um, and there could be something about a child here as well someone won't go along with something here that these people have been trying to do someone's definitely in despair someone is loyal to you um, or there's something about friendship here someone did something unjust but it's not working in the recent past. It has to do with fortune, your fortune, something meant to be, money, actual money. Um, there's something about you being unique or thinking outside of the box. 
you just being yourself um, versus someone here that's been trying to cover something up or wear a mask. Um, there's a lot of secrets connected to this. Nine of Wands reverse. Someone isn't constant with someone. Someone is not going to continue. Um, this some sort of seductive energy is not going to work. Someone is not exalted. Someone is not going to continue with someone. Someone can't be sold a dream. Um, and someone can't defend themselves. They, they shouldn't have taken this risk. Yeah, someone did something in the recent past that's backfiring. Nine of Pentacles reverse. Um, someone is not someone's friend. Someone, maybe they can't take care of themselves or they're a gold digger. Someone here is trying to, someone's real duplicitous. Someone's not a true friend. Um, someone shouldn't have been so impulsive um, in, the in the near future. Someone won't negotiate with someone. Someone could be begging or need something from someone. They won't negotiate. Um, someone is, if someone's duplicitous, they're not their friend. Someone could be getting pushed out of a group. Um, there's a lot of secrets going on here. Someone could be keeping secrets from someone that tried to get you caught up. Uh, with a lot of secrets now, I feel like it's backfiring on them. Um, it has to do with you not being isolated. Um, and someone doesn't have a choice about it. <clears throat> you could have had a child with someone too. There could be something about that. Um, Nine of Cups reverse, Queen of Pentacles. For some reason, there's something about you not being ill or sick. Um, I don't know if someone will try to say that you're unstable somehow or that they wanted you to be sick or saying you're sick or unwell but you're very much doing well and someone here can't stand it um i don't know if someone was trying to say you party or over party or there's someone here that does party too much or someone's afraid of seeing you be happy they don't want you to be smug queen of pentacles i see you doing well um Someone can't distract someone about you. It's all a distraction. Something's not a dream come true. You're a very generous person. There's something about someone trying to block an affair or someone doesn't want to have an affair with someone. You're very innovative. Um, you seem focused on your things you're building here. Um, someone can't dominate you or dominate someone about you. Um, there's someone here trying to flatter someone. Someone's real two-faced. It's not working. Three of Cups reverse. Someone won't talk to someone in this group. Um, they're losing their control. Someone has to be very careful. I feel like people, someone can't trust their group. Because these people aren't getting anything out of this situation. Yeah, someone won't negotiate. They won't talk. They won't negotiate. The contract's over. They won't talk to this person. Um, someone's losing their control. People see you have this cornucopia around you, plus you're grateful. I feel like you're very giving as well. Um, they, these people can't keep going. Someone can't keep going. They don't have patience for this. They won't negotiate. Something's going to come out about this wife. That's what someone's worried about. They feel like you're going to be happy. There's going to be something that helps you express yourself here. Um, yeah, it's going to be a whole drama. They're worried about it. Um, it's going to create a huge loss. Um, I don't, and you're very innovative, too. And that's, you know, someone's been trying to block you from expressing yourself. It's like it's going to expose this, this person or these people for trying to hold you back or down. Um, there was some type of a gamble going on here. Um, and all it did was create a lack of harmony for themselves. And they're being seen as people that block har harmonious people or harmonious situations. Um, something that maybe you inherited your birthright or this could have to do with your actual inheritance. Someone gambling trying to gamble with something that's, that's yours 
by criticizing you, um, criticizing someone who has this cornucopia here, and is very sharing and giving, sharing, someone that shares a lot is very giving, um, and there's something about some type of like an affair or something here, where someone has to be very cautious, they have to be very cautious now, because I feel like they're exposed, someone can't escape a situation, um, in this organization, there's like people finding out about something here. Um, yeah, something could be public, some sort of news or information or emails or messages traveling around. Um, something could be very big too, depending on what the situation is here with this publicity card. Something could be coming out. Um, yeah, someone's got to be very, very careful. Um, about their next moves <sighs> and misfortune is the outcome and something is actually not a surprise someone's making plans here they've got to make a move um, it has to do with this leaving this organization or this organization falling apart or losing support of an organization. There's a bunch of misfortune here. Inheritance under the deck. If someone tried to steal your money, um, or something that was meant for you, it's something's coming up or out. There's arguments about it. And people might know something's about to happen as well. It's a big tower. This inheritance could be your birthright. Something that was meant for you is meant for you that you're carrying through in spite of these people. Someone's in despair about something, and it's shameful. Um, so we'll leave it there for now. If you resonate, I hope that it helps, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.